Okay, smooth. We're going to work on the last uh, fast like solo, the fastest part of the solo before he goes into that like song ending outro jam session. Two, three, and... Yeah, I did pretty well, except for totally forgetting where to go at the end. Uh, at the very first part, place we're going to start is to make sure you're playing the right notes. Now, you've only got about five notes that you need for this solo, and then you play them over and over and over again. Where are those notes? I'll tell you. Put your first finger on the twelfth fret of your E string. Now you know that that starts over at E, right? Now we're going to walk up, F, F sharp, G, G sharp, A. That's an A. Well, why do we want that? This is an A minor. It's harmonic minor, but we'll get into that later. So, if you play your fifth pentatonic pattern, on whatever fret this is, I'm assuming it's 17 because on the 5th fret, you have an A. On the 5th fret above the octave, you also have an A. Alright, that was not what I wanted. Um, so I actually don't know the fret numbers, and quite frankly I don't care. Um, I just want to know what key I'm in. I'm in the key of A. This is an A. Alright, now if you play your 5th pentatonic pattern, If you don't know that pattern, this solo will be too hard. If you don't have it in your brain right now, play it a hundred times so that it gets in your brain and then come back to us. Alright, we're going to play the last part first. The reason we're doing that is because it's the easiest part. Um, it has the easiest rhythm, and um, the rhythm is really what is tricky about this song. So <clears throat> let's just get that out of the way, have a little bit of fun. So we're in our fifth pentatonic pattern. If we walk up, you get to that uh, third finger bend. That's your fourth scale degree in this scale pattern. It's the most common note to bend. Keep going. Here's seven. That's the second most common note to bend. Um, and then back to one, three. We're actually not going to bend this third. So you really want to know where this seven and this four is. Okay, seven's under your pinky. Four is under your third finger. We're going to start on this pinky note. Now the rhythm is one E and a two E and a three E. One E and a two E and a three E. Those are sixteenth notes. Count with me. Ready? Go. One E and a two E and a three E. Again, count out loud and go. And one E and a two E and a three E. So, here are the notes. Starting on that 7, up to 1, pull off 7, 5. These are scale degrees that I'm calling out, by the way. And then a bend on this 4. Remember that most common bend? So we have 1, E, and a. Uh. Okay, play your pinky, say 1. Ready, go. 1. Play your first finger and say E. Go. E. Do a pull off from pinky to first on the B string and say and a. Uh. Go. And a. Uh. Let's do all that. Say it out loud. Ready? Count. One, E, and a. Uh. Now bend your four up, your fourth scale degree up. Uh, then say two. Two. Bend it back down say E. E. Pull off and say and. And. So we have two, E, and. So let's do two E and again. Ready? Count out loud. Two E and. Again, ready? Count. Two E and. Good. Now we go down to the root. A. Uh, three E. So you just hammer on. So let's do two E and a three E. We're on the G and the D strings only here. First and third finger. Again, ready? 
and two E and a three E. Ready again and two E and a three E. Ready again and two E and a three E. Ready again and two E and a three E. Let's do that whole part. One E and a two E and a three E. Let's do it together. Ready? Count out loud. Ready? Play. One E and a two E and a three E. Ready? Again. And one E and a two E and a three E. I sped up, sorry. Ready? Again, and one E and a two E and a three E. Ready again, and one E and a two E and a three E. I'm adding some bends, sorry. Ready, and one. Two, three, three. Okay, with the metronome. Ready, and a go E and a. Again, and. Alright, speeding up. Ready, and. Again, and. Faster. Ready, 60 beats per minute. Ready, and. One more time. Alright, sorry. Ready, and. Sixty six. Ready, play. Again, and seventy two. Ready, and clipping. Ready, again. Eighty beats. I think it's somewhere around like one fifteen. We're gonna go all the way to like one thirty just to be idiots. Ready and <laughs> ready. This is nice. Ready, go. Make your uh, solo face if you have to. Ready and uh, this is eighty-eight. Ready and ooh, I didn't do so well. Ready and. Ninety-six. One, two, right on. Uh, Arnold. It's pretty fast. Ready in. One hundred. Ready. Two, three, four. One more time. Ready in. Again. Ready in. Ready in. 108, ready in. Ah. Did you get it? I did not. Ready in. Ah. I hope you're doing better than me. Ready in. As far as picking, um, I definitely suggest down, up, down. Just alternate picking. Down, up, down. Up, down, up. There's a lot of hammer-ons and pull-offs there where you're not picking. That's why it's not down and up every single note, but down and up every single time you pick, which is not every note. I don't know if that makes sense. If you feel like you can play this without the metronome, but not with the metronome, you're wrong. When the metronome's off, you just don't realize that you suck. With that in mind, one, two, ready, and I think I realize I suck with the metronome <laughs> or without it. Ready, ready, and I think it's a lot faster than this, so I think that might be why I'm having a hard time at the end of the song. Ready, and ready, and ready, and. 
Ready, and... <laughs> I am maxed out. This is 112 and I can't do it. Ready, and... <laughs> 